everyone. So we're on the Amtrak. So we have to let them start planning to do this. I thought you wanted to show them your versatility. <laughs> Better work, Val. We're on our way to Philly. It's gonna be like an hour. Um, she's really excited and great spirits. Y'all already know how I feel today. So, oh, how does she feel? How does she feel? Girl, <laughs> you gotta ask the people. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Watch them people. Maybe I just need a cocktail. No. Not if you feel it away. The girls made it. We're at 30th Street Station in Philadelphia. <laughs> Me and Philly finna get silly. Where the niggas at? Ah! I'm trying to get my cookie scratch. Ah! <laughs> they know what it is. So yeah. <laughs> the Terra Squad is currently coming. Terra Squad, what's good? Ah, 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 we out here. Good in yourself. Yes, stop the tune. Stop doing that, girl. What is you doing, girl? The fuck are you getting straight? I can't. I cannot. I'm not doing it. Don't run from it. Lean into it. Don't run. Oh. All right. Oh, I told you it was raining. I told you. Now we out here giving. Why? Shut the fuck you up. Feel it look crazy. It look crazy. Look crazy. Hey, you look Going crazy. Going through the way. Like for real. Wanting to start doing. again. Do you ever feel like a. What's the next word? If anybody want a sister. If anybody want a sister. I come at a high price. Free. High price. Free. That's just this today's deal. <laughs> I'm still not okay. Fuck it. Oh, that was cute. Fuck it. It's cute. We made it to our telly. Oh, that's kind of to me like. Now I don't like those mirrors. That's like a zoom in mirror. Like it magnifies you. I think. But you can't see anything. Get real close. It's gonna kill you. Oh hell no. <laughs> I told you I hate those mirrors. Y'all, we are in our room. Look at our walk-in shower with um, our toilage. Uh-uh, because I'll call. I will. I'll, no. Oh, no, so I am going to call downstairs, and I'm going to let them know that it's a dog next door. And because I am that girl, um, yeah, this is kind of This is... Cut so Shabbat. This is so bad. Now, sister, you can start sending me money if you start touching these snacks. That's where, that's where you can send me the money for the incidental stage. So this, this is gorge. This is oh, this is gorge. Yeah. Yeah, this is Cut Shabbat. We love that. Okay. Hi. Hi. Oh. All right, guys. We're going to figure out where we're going to get something to eat. And then I will be back. All right, you guys. So, let me see what you can see. Do you see what I see? All right. Because um, I see the body. 
Okay, I gotta stop. We are about to get ready. Mermaid is in the shower. This view is gorgeous. But Mermaid is in the shower. I'm about to do my like a really light, 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 light beat real quick. Quick little underpainting. And then I'm gonna get in the shower. We're going to try to find like a lounge type of situation or just like, you know, light foods and maybe like a drink, like a cocktail. And then probably come back to the hotel and change and figure out what we're gonna do tonight. That will be fun. I'm starting to feel better. Anytime I'm around my sister, I feel so much better. Sometimes I am like my own worst enemy, especially in a room by myself, especially when it's me in my bedroom by myself, because that's where I feel most comfortable and that's where my brain feels most comfortable taking me through it. So I'm just going to keep taking deep breaths. I am going to um, really, really take these next few weeks and probably months to not rebrand, but refocus everything that I want to do. Because I feel like it's just like, I have a lot of projects that I was starting, but then I fell out of love with, which is also a part of me having like ADHD, but not having it diagnosed or doing anything to work on it. So, you know, I lose focus. Stress and anxiety comes from me not finishing these projects, feeling like I'm failing myself, feeling, feeling like I'm not reaching my goals and, you know, um, really honing my full potential. And in certain ways... I'm 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 not holding my full potential and I really feel like you know if I had better control of the ADHD because I lose focus a lot and it throws me into a cycle and and when all of that and, and a lot of that also like what people don't talk about with ADHD is like also the loss of motivation because you beat up on yourself because you feel like oh I started something and I didn't finish it or I started it finished it didn't publish it um so you kind of really just start this crazy cycle that I'm really over i'm over it i'm ready i'm ready to unlock that part of my brain that you know i haven't been able to tap into or maybe not not unlock it but just really manage it better so that i'm able to just do the shit that be on my mind because i got some crazy fun ideas that i really want to produce and show you all and yeah sometimes it's just everyday stuff like laundry and getting out of the bed taking a shower like all of those things like are affected when you have ADHD and you just feel like I procrastinate to the last minute and that's been something I've done my whole life. I've tried a bunch of ways not to, but yeah. We are going to get some food because my sister's really hungry. I'm hungry too, I only had a salad today. So um, yeah, I'm gonna start my makeup over here. And yeah, I've already kind of made a mess. So let's get going. Spicy. Is it good, darling? <laughs> hey y'all, so we are at now this place I don't know the name no, of um, but <laughs> I think it's graffiti bar. No, graffiti bar is down the alley. Anyway, we're at like a um it's like a pan Asian uh fusion type of place. We got these cute margaritas. She got a strawberry margarita, I got a spicy margarita, so good. I'll sip so it on, tasty. Sip it on Cam. <laughs> exactly the sound effect that I needed. Shrimp pad thai. Oh, I'm finna give me some of that. The bang bang shrimp. You gotta get you some of that. Yeah. And try a Brussels sprout. It's so good. Yeah. One thing we're gonna do is what? Eat, bitch. We're gonna eat. What about that? Not you dip that. You are so bandy. Right, bitch. What about the and the legs? Look at her and her. Who can I pay to take this? I want to see if you like the Brussels sprout. Oh. That's, um... Banji Tanji. Banji Tanji Khan. That's what I told you, girl. Okay, so but we in Philly. We eating on the street. Everybody getting in to the city. Never seen girls like us before. The girls is out. We just fine ass dreadheads right across the street from us. Fine. Ooh. Come on over. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. <laughs>
up, y'all? So we are at the Suzanne Roberts Theater for the screening of Eminem. Sister. Yeah, so we are in the Philly's Theater District. And it's cute. It's a beautiful day. It's warm. Saturday morning. Get into it. And yeah, the girls are out. I'll show you our outfits in a few. We're probably going to do like content later. Let me stay in the light. But yeah, they're gonna open up the, we just went inside to like see about the seating and stuff and they're gonna open up the theater in about 10 minutes. Yeah. And yeah, I don't know if we're supposed to tell anybody that we're coming in, but I don't know. Cause I guess they're showing multiple films. So. I think so, that's what they usually do with like multiple films. Okay. Cute. Yes. Yeah. At Black Star Fest and use the hashtag BSFF23. Please keep your mask on and be mindful of the folks around you and please properly discard of trash and keep this clean. Hey y'all, so the screening was amazing. Merci. 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 Come on, girl, show them the push. Ooh, she's around. <laughs> so we're looking at that. Oh, 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 where the camera was at. Baby, the knockers. <laughs> They're out. This is my bag, my little butterfly detail. Oh, no, I took my M off. My M has a butterfly on it, too. Okay, I am going to look. Oh wow. So this is what they think of me? This is my menu. Hers is a mermaid depicting mermaid. Mine is a hog. <laughs> I'll take that. She thick. <laughs> but we're gonna get something to eat and then probably go back to the hotel, uh, hotel chill out for a while. And then figure out what we're gonna do for the rest of the evening. And we just found out today. My fucking titty tonight. We just found out, we just found out today that we have a radio interview tomorrow as well as a panel. We know about the panel, but we ain't know about no radio interview. So we gotta go back and go back and forth with our producer with an email to like find exactly where we're supposed to be at what time. Oh, we have a dinner with our producer and stuff later. So I'm gonna be like, Miss E, whoa, why you didn't remind or like say nothing for real? But we'll figure it out. And yeah, so. It's the middle of the weekend in Philly. We're still getting silly. The film was amazing. Of course, I can only record so much because like it's a screening, so you really don't want to record because you're not the whole still, but. Hello, how are you? Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Did you want to go ahead and put any drinks in right now? Um, or just a what was, is there like a, she said it was a brunch. Oh, oh yeah, there's a special, this, it's a sea bass taco, and it has like crunchy jalapenos and um, sweet potato puree. <laughs> so we're ordering. I'll be back soon. We got a spicy pineapple margarita with tahini on the rim. Tahini on the rim. A frozen strawberry margarita for her. <laughs> Ooh, sister. I want her to pay the comments on the social media. You gotta pay it, Stinka. It's gonna take up all your time. Because it's like, how do people that don't, like... Because, girl... But we know at this point, people that have hate in their hearts, they can't pay it. It's how they function. It's so rude to me. Listen, anybody out there, if you're experiencing hate, some of us smile, and some of us choose to frown. Be the one that keeps on smiling. Don't let it make you frown, girl. Don't just turn the comments off. <laughs> but we just ordered, I just ordered like mad tacos. And she ordered quesadilla and a taco. And then I got us a nachos and salsa appetizer. And we got our drinky drink. Tahini on the rim. You could have went a little bit heavier with the tahini, but yeah. Try a chill. I'm gonna try it in a hot pepper. The chips are warm, really good. 
Oh, thank God they have this. I thought it was gonna be more pureed. It's like all tomato. You can eat the guac. <laughs> it's good. Excited for your quesadilla, sister? I am. Hey, y'all. So we are at our interview. Oh, hello. We are at our um, our radio interview it's before the panel. It's Sunday. Hey, sister. Spent the whole weekend. Got another week to go. What's going on? We are here at the Daily Joe on stage. Yes. And um, we're getting ready to start now. I will talk to her when I figure out what I'm going to eat. Okay. Back at the hotel, we got some Wendy's. I'm about to um eat. Pack my bag up. We got extended check out to 12:30, but we got to be at our panel 30 minutes before. And I think it's like, <coughs> oh, thank you. I'm just watching some Netflix. Trial by Media is really good. Oh my god, my nose is. Oh, I should probably take a Zyrtec. It might be my allergies. Okay, we gonna eat this and then pack my stuff up. And then I will talk to y'all when we get back to, we just had a radio interview, but we literally had to run, but we're going right back to the same place. So I'll show you that place there area when we get there. And then we leave right after our train is at what, 4.05, 4.30. Okay. Yeah, I think our train here was 3.05 and the one back is like 4.30. Sorry that was so blurry. It, it's been really difficult keeping my iPhone camera clear. Thank you all for watching and putting up on my shit. I'm gonna get a new vlog from camera. Thanks, out. Hey y'all, so I am at the panel. We're back, as you can see. Our bags are still at the hotel, so that's pretty chill. We, um, I mean, we pretty much checked out, but we got a late checkout, but I mean, we left before then and they still got our bags, so. They know the thing, because they're in partnership with the actual Black Star Film Festival here in Philly. It is starting to fill up. I'm really excited. Um, last time we were talking to a few people, but we were, all, we were also recording that um, for a pre-recorded interview, and I think like the wrap-up video and all of that good stuff. So now we get to really talk to like a live studio audience, which you know I love, of all. And yeah, super cute, all green cheers. What's the hat for the vlog? Hi, darling. What's going on? <laughs> we are getting ready, as they say, to take them to church, honey and give them some good things, some good um, balls of knowledge that we've all gained through our films, through filmmaking, through our lives and storytelling, and really be able to, you know, affect the crowd in the last little bit. This is the closing day of the film festival, so yeah, it's really exciting. And then after this, I think our train is at 410, so we'll probably head to, because the train station is literally around the corner. Everything has been around the corner. We literally haven't gone further than a mile, I think, all weekend. So... We'll probably head to the train from the hotel around 3.30. And then that's just the hour. And then once I get home, once we get back to New York, I'm going home. I think Mermaid is going out. I have to be to work in the morning, Monday and Tuesday. And then, woo, and yeah. Mm.